America's armed services personnel, the men and women who wear the uniform, face a variety of issues when transitioning back to civilian life. One of the most significant of those concerns is the search for a new job and a new career. Reporter LaTanya Parker recently met with a group preparing for that challenge by learning how to dress for success. I've been in the Army for 26 years, so we kind of told what you were going to wear and all that. Course, Army Colonel sure. Peter Curry is preparing to re-enter civilian life by suiting up in a whole new kind of uniform. I didn't really know what a custom fit was going to be until I actually put it on and, and saw the difference. We tightened up that Curry has enlisted the services of Master Tailor Sophia Barone. Shoulders are about perfect for you. At his shop outside of Washington, D.C., Sophia offers separating service personnel like Colonel Curry discounts on custom fitted suits and shares what he's learned about clothing over the course of a lifetime. These people are in a a very precarious situation. They, they need to know about clothing. We're, I'm a clothing expert. This is something we can help them with. You're going to be going through the interview process, and that's where I'm going to step in. Once a month, Sophia takes his message free of charge to soldiers enrolled in the Transition Assistance Program at Fort Myer, Virginia. I got issued my first set of BDUs for my 18th birthday. His workshop provides them with basic information on wardrobe selection. A lot of them don't quite understand the fundamentals. Once you tell them those and tell them how many suits they should be wearing, what colors they should be wearing, what's appropriate and what is inappropriate, we find that it's much, much easier for them to transition out and actually look like they're professional. The primary focus for the Dress for Success workshop is about finding the appropriate attire to find the perfect job. However, Participants are also gaining insight and confidence on making great first impressions. It is so much that you get. I mean, I got tons of notes, and I'm going to review those and make sure that my wardrobe looks exactly like he said. Absolutely. It's a, uh, one of the steps, I guess, to success in the outside world. Colonel Curry says Sofio showed him the importance of looking the part in searching for the job you want. You know that if you look good, you feel good you'll probably do well in your job. Yes, Having a good suit will help you transition to a new life and uh, you can feel comfortable doing it. Yeah. Feel comfortable? Yeah, absolutely. Sophia's workshops stress four key elements when choosing the right interview outfit. Dress as well as your budget will allow. Invest in one good interview outfit. Be as well groomed as possible. And make sure your interview clothes are appropriate for the job. If you are scheduled to separate from military service, you can find additional information about finding civilian employment through the Department of Labor. Visit the Veterans Employment and Training Service website at www.dol.gov vets.